Hey there, everyone, Petapons and Saucepans in particular. Yeah, we're doing one of these. It's wheel time. Why not? It's been so long, and I have free time today, plus I have additional free time from um, not having to record Spyro this morning. So I was like, you know what? I want to do this. I want to do a wheel event. Again, like, it's probably too early. Because the two games in the coffer, like, are gonna be long ones, I don't know, but you know what, it doesn't matter. I wanna do this, so we're gonna be doing this. Uh, this might be a shorter wheel event. For one thing, uh, my, um, personal pick, the R zone pick, is already done. Uh, if you've seen the coming up uh, coming up next list on either in, in Talk House or in the Patapon Spot Zone, you know what it is. You could even argue that, no, you don't need to make it your pick, but I choose to. I think it's just fair. I just feel better that way. So, uh, yeah, consider that for your own safety. <laughs> the safety of knowledge. And uh, so, yeah, if you don't know what it is, when you find out what it is, it's going to make a whole lot of sense. And it is, as of now, the last known A-side temporary revival zone spot. So, uh, as you can see here, this is just Royal Wheel. We're returning to the classic mode. Uh, I love doing the Chaos Wheel last time, but someone did the math. And it's more likely than not that every event would have multiple um, Royals, which is fun. But it's kind of like, I, I, it's fun as a sometimes thing, but I don't want it to be the regular thing. So, doing Wheels Classic today, kinda. So, let's just go uh, to join in. All you need to do is be on my Patreon and there, like, look for the post with a potato that's pinned and you fill out the Google form. Wow, fantastic. What a concept. If you're feeling on joining it or anyone's in particular, Make sure not to do so from the iPhone app, because now Apple will ask for a cut. Hooray for landlords! Alright, but don't mind about that. Just if you're gonna be doing transactions, make sure you do it from a website. That's just how it be now. Here we go, check it out, the winner of the Royal Leafia! Barrett. That sounds like someone who got in from Patreon directly. Wow, yeah, Lufia Barrett was a very recent um, submission, like third from the bottom. Like, you just, you just got in. Well, here you go. You didn't have to wait long at all. Lufia Barrett. I will be looking at your submissions later. And I will choose from amongst the three game you have given to me. However, if you wish to change those games, if they're not up to date or whatever, it is uh, your responsibility to get in touch with me. Uh, Discord is what I prefer because that is, permits direct interaction. But if you just want to send me a Patreon DM, that is also fine. Just, you know, there might be just... Communication through the M is always a little bit slower, but leave ya bear it. You did it. You won All right, so here we are in the big uh, Wheel of big old games game wheel game game wheel with a bunch of meta options uh, There's not really nearly 800 games. <laughs> there's a there's a few meta options in here just for fun Just to spice things up if we feel the need to but, before we do this, if you'll remember, during the Chaos Wheel event, I picked up two games first, and I sort of vetoed out when it became three Royal winning championship. Well, I put these two games aside, and uh, I we're going to start with those. Those are part of this poll. Afterwards, we're going to spill the wheel three times. But what are these two games? Uh, the first one... <laughs> First one is The Legend of Zelda Minish Cap, just starting off with a pretty strong monster there. At the time, I think I was just done with Zelda 1, like the extended 4 run of Zelda 1. And so I, I kind of was bimmied out a little bit, I, I, was, I was hoping it wouldn't win. But now time has passed, and also there's going to be the time associated with... 
the two games that are still left that are gonna take a while as well as the game that might finish a side might take a while so i don't so you know by the time we get there i wouldn't mind playing a zelda Playing the Zelda Minish Cap, all I know about it is that it is a 2D Zelda game. Like, and people like it, and I think it's by Capcom. Like, that's it. That's all I know. If you want, need to play a pure Zelda purely without having played it before. Like, yeah, second quest was my first time, but I knew the, the engine underneath it. Minish Cap would be a brand new experience for me, if that matters. I feel like it might. It's a very strong first contender kind of almost unfairly so but there we are man that is not a long trailer but the other game i picked was amiagari no hanabi i think hanabi means uh fireworks right so when's the last time did i play a weird kind of janky japanese dujin platformer well i say dujin i don't think it's based on anything like i think it's an original thing but this game just looks adorable! It's a little, like, action platformer with, like, the cutest squirrel in the universe. And, uh, it's based around fireworks, and it looks pretty intense! It's a Japanese platformer style. I, like I said, it's been so long since I played one of these. It almost feels like a non... A non, uh, a non, a non toho toho, almost, and just the vibe. It looks so cool! It looks like just absolutely fantastic. According to one of these thumbnails, there are bugs and oddities. What everyone loves. I just think this looks super rad. And I, I would super look into playing this. With that said, three more games. So we get five. So here we go. Oh, I didn't shuffle. Eh, that's fine. I did not shuffle. It happens. Sometimes I just forget to shuffle. Oh, oh boy. All right, game number three, even though it's the first spin. Okay. We, when's the last poll? That would be, that would be the mega event where there were like 30 games. Okay, I know what game I want it to be then. If it weren't for the fact that I have a pretty important game coming up, this probably would have been my R Zone pick. Anodyne. It is, I believe, a Zelda like. This is an old trailer that doesn't have frames, but that's okay. Um, I don't know a whole lot about this game because I was told I need to not know a whole lot to really before I play this game. But I know it does stuff, uh, and it plays around with menace a little bit, I think, I'm not sure. Point is, I don't, I remember how during the mega event, I said, please vote for this game, and my plan was that this would have been at least somewhere in the top six, so that if it was between four, five, or six, I could play it then. But that didn't happen. It ended up like 7th place or 8th place. And I was like, no, well, okay, then I guess. And then I played Spiral 3, which I'm enjoying and I'm loving, so like, it's fine. Everything I'm playing normally is pretty good, but I guess this is my pitch for Anodyne. <laughs> I want to know what's up with this game. I heard it's super rad cool. And I mean, yeah, I'm looking at this, you know, yeah, it looks like a pretty solid 2D Zelda-style Zelda-like. But there's something else, and I need to know what that else is. See, it has an analysis video thumbnail, and another thumbnail of a guy looking mildly constipated. So you know it's you know you know it's you know it's a good time. It's a video game, Mo modern tournament every Monday, 6 p.m. That's not the case for me. All right, well that was weird. High choice. Let's go. All right. So that's three games that, technically speaking, <laughs> were not rolled. Like, I chose that one. I'm not supposed to choose. I'm supposed to be dictated from the universe. From the wheel. Wheel it up, Berserk boy. Whoa, March this year. Yeah, I remember seeing the, the, the trailer for this and going like, yeah, no, yeah, that's a game I want to play. 
Check it out, it's a bird with fire! Fire ahead bird! And it's a Mega Man. Whoa! <laughs> yeah! Yeah! It's all coming back! Ah! It looks so good! It looks so fun! Gravity Circuit was by far, like, what was one of my favorite games last year. This looks like one of those! It looks like Sonic Mega Man! Like, dude just flies through these levels! Honestly, graphic style reminds me a bit of Iconoclast, of all things. I don't know if it's related or anything. Or maybe I'm just dumb. I don't know. Check it out, Turtle Beam! And you got all the robot people, including the slow-looking scooter. No, that that looked extremely gravity circuit. Can pet a dog. Way to spoiler that part, buddy. Trailer. This looks so good. It just looks so good. If you just if if your goal by choosing from this poll is to ensure that I have a swell positive time, I I think this is the way to go. You know, it got a tech review. It's got a little like assemblage of thumbnails there, probably like bosses. You know, that's pretty good. Oh, this art is a bit good. Says another trailer. Yeah, you know what? Those are good things to know about. I don't know who I want to win this poll. Well, let's make it even harder by rolling... This one I am going to shuffle. Whoa! Mid-something shuffle! That's right! Hey, you can see here. You can't see my cursor, but I added it, the Halo series to... <laughs> to the list after my adventure with Halo 3. It made, a, it made, it made an impact. Grapple Force Rena! Another 2D, like, funky game. I don't know which one I want. I guess I'll take this one. Commercial trailer just sounds so weird. A trailer for the television. <laughs> Alright, Grapple Force Rena! This looks a lot like my initial impression is, uh. I don't know. Yeah, different production value from the last one, but that's okay. Check it out! We got swing! Yeah, that's right! We're swinging here. Remember... Remember... Rusted Moss? This looks a lot more video gamey. Like, here are some video game levels. You want... You want... You, you want to be using grapple in a Mario 3... Airship? Now's our chance, buddy. No, yeah, this looks great. Snatch! Snatch those arms! Throw them back! Make them... Yeah, that's right! Shield time! Okay, so like, it's this. Ooh, this looks cool, actually. You got a little overdrive ostrich section. Yeah, or just riding a guy. Lotus pods, turn it through helicopters. Everyone knows that. Everything, anything. Those are different words. Uh, well, that guy's just had a great time. Check it out. There's an ant. Uh, very spiky ant. And a gondola ride for everyone. That's right, pool time, idiot. No, I'm digging this. Oh, that's a penguin! Like a little penguin knight. Penguin warrior. And the Floridians are back, too. If you're into that. Fight! This giant, massive fan! Or that guy. Why not? He's got a tank. Gotta fight a tank. Yeah, a little, little sand bug living in the sand. Oh, watch out. It's the boss. Money! Oh, it's got portal, so be careful. Gravel Force Arena looks really good. Like, it just looks like a lot of fun. Try the web demo. I'm not gonna do that. If I'm gonna play your game, I'm gonna play it, like, from the start. Just absolutely. No, yeah, that looks fun. I don't know if it plays in this in this list, which is, you know, makes me go, like, a little bit like, mm-hmm, mm-hmm, mm-hmm. But it looks really cool. Like, it really does. So, these are the five that you're going to be choosing from. Two Zelda, well, one Zelda, one Zelda-like, uh, Japanese, um, uh, platformer. And two, like, uh, very action-y, well, one very fast uh, Mega Man-style-like platformer. And a grappling bar swinging Mega Man style platformer. 
These are definitely games and genres I love. So no matter what wins, I'm pretty sure I'm going to be real happy with the results. But hey, y'all get to vote. There's going to be a link on the post that's going to lead to that that rank vote choice uh, website. Then you're going to choose one. You're going to like, wow, I'm going to choose that one. And someone somewhere is going to applaud for completely completely unrelated reason leaf yeah i'm gonna check your choices but get in touch with me if you think they should be different i mean considering that yeah you are a pretty recent uh submitter i'm gonna assume you haven't changed your mind but i shouldn't assume so i'm not but that's why you put in games first now so you know at least they're there anyways i'm babbling week week long week time long week we <laughs> what am I saying? Words are just struggling to come out. Got weak, so I don't know. At some point next Thursday, Tuesday is when the thing vote is going to end. I say that, but like 99% of the voting gets done in the first 24 hour. But for the 1% left, you know, I'm, I'm, I'm going to keep it living for a week. It's fine. It's good. Video games may be a mistake, but they're here to stay.